Hey yo, everyone, welcome back to my channel. Shoes dirty. Your shoes are dirty? Yes, I get on mud shoes. Well guys, welcome back to my channel. We are here with another Shop With Me video. Actually at Target. I'm at one of the I super get... targets right now. I'm gonna be doing kind of like the hygiene haul shop with me. It's so it's so gloomy right now. I wish it was sunny because I got a cute little pink on. My nails are bright. Got pink little scrunchies on. But it's dull outside. It's been about two weeks since I've been in the stores. Want to see if they've stocked anything. If there's anything new. We're gonna let Emran sleep for a little bit longer, and then we're gonna go inside and get to shopping. All right, so we have some Dove lotions. We got the Glowing and Shea Butter here. I don't think I've seen these. And then they have the Deep Nourishment. Maybe they've had these before, but they're in new packaging. I don't know. I've never used Raw Sugars lotions. I use their body wash. It's okay, but the scent is not very strong. I hated their body scrubs, though. I wonder if their lotions are better, but they have santal and caffeine, clementine and fig, hibiscus and island fruit, and shea and rice flour. I'm seeing the hemp, sweet jasmine and rose. I'm trying to think if I have anything currently to go with this. I don't think I have any rose products. I should have taken a picture of everything that I have because now that I'm in here, I'm like blinking. I really want to try this melanin glow from Jergens, though, I think. This would pair really nicely with the new Dove melanin body wash that I got. What's this for face? I'm seeing some new scents from Finery. This magnetic candy it smells more floral than I thought it would. This pistachio, please, smells so good. This one smells amazing. This would be good for a man or a woman. Nice and masculine. Love, love the Midnight Cafe. Sweet on the outside is good. I feel like we have this one. The new Rouge. We finery has such great scents. Oh, this is a good one. That's lighter than I thought it would be. Okay, my favorites are the Flower Bed Without a Trace Pistachio, please, and Midnight Cafe. I'm kind of debating if I want to get a scent or not. I feel like this one would be perfect for the warmer weather. I still have not tried any of the native facial care line. Have you guys tried it? Coconut Vanilla and the Facial Cleanser Facial Lotion. Then they have the Sensitive one. Then we have the brightening for citrus and bergamot but also in the honey and i don't know how to pronounce this cigarro they have another moisturizing cleanser in sage and sweet citrus and then they have the sensitive facial moisturizer with aloe and vitamin b3 simple micellar cleansing water I feel like I used to use Simple back in the day. I can't remember if I liked it or not though. I feel like that Hemp's lotion I was just talking about would go well with the Moroccan Rose or maybe even the Pink Hibiscus. But I know I don't have any of those scrubs at home right now. What is this? Pixie Hydra Lip Treatment. These are pretty colors. And they have clear. I really like Pixie. I was thinking it was for the cheeks, but it's for the lips. Pixie on the glow super glow. $18. The blushes too. Retinal capsule care. Yeah, Pixie has a vitamin C remedy mask. Vitamin C priming oil, brightening perfecter, and under eye brightener. What? <laughs> Imran just tooted. Yes. Thank you for letting me know that. I saw these in the last shop with me and I kind of want to try them. Oh wait, there's different ones. Notice that last time? So they have immunity the bodyguard in the blackberry flavored then we have chocolate raspberry for the pleasure wait what the pleasure seeker the what pleasure seeker oh it's for your mood definitely not what i thought it was for orange nectarine flavored for beauty chews and daily chews the brain booster cafe latte flavored I don't think I noticed that they had different flavors for different things last time. I kind of want to try them. I'm not going to lie. I don't know if I can take these while breastfeeding though. That's the only thing. But the other Target has a wider variety of Frenchie products. I've never tried Bioma's products and I really love the packaging. I kind of want to give them a go. I don't know what I would try though. They have a melting balm cleanser, a milky oil cleanser, creamy jelly cleanser, brightening toner, hydrating milky toner, balancing face mist. 
see, I don't have a face mist. I kind of have stuff that I love from the La Roche Posay line, but I don't have a face mist from them, so I might pick this up. And they have a hydrating serum, sensitive retinol oil, moisturizing gel cream, moisturizing rich cream. Oh, a gel sunscreen. I've never seen this before. Coco Kind Ceramide Body Oil Stick for moisture and skin barrier support. So does it provide? moisture if you're like dry somewhere for sensitive skin this ceramide packed body oil stick moisturizes and supports the skin barrier developed for easy mess-free application and instantly leaves skin soft and radiant they also have a kp smoothing stick cure ultra hydrating green juice cleanser for 14. Oh, Bacne Warrior. I do not have Bacne, but I've never seen this from Pacifica. That's pretty cool. Bacne Fighting Body Spray. Future Youth line. Is this new? So this is Gravity Rebound, and then they have a Super Cream and a SPF. I don't normally take a long time to go through the like skincare aisle. This stuff could have been here for a while, and I just didn't know it because I don't typically look through this stuff. I don't think that belongs here. fix this up a little bit there we go there that looks a little nicer hydrating milky cleanser in snow mushroom okay interesting i used their um facial not that their facial toners before and it actually did not work well for my skin but i'm kind of interested in the snow mushroom <laughs> I am going to get some chopsticks for the kids' Easter baskets. I still have that one cleansing wash. I'm not seeing it over here. It might be somewhere else. But when I'm out of it, I want to try this Naturium cleansing balm. I've used their, like, serums before, and I actually liked them a little bit. So I want to kind of branch out. I don't think there's any new Tree Hut scrubs. I was debating if I wanted to get the Tropic Glow stuff now. Target has finally caught up. They have the new Dove stuff and I'm seeing a different scent than before. They have a cucumber melon one and they didn't have those at the Walmart that we saw last time. Also, I don't think we saw the lemon scented native from Girl Scout line last time we went through all their Girl Scout scents. Don't remember seeing lemon, I don't know. Moisture, they are packed with the she moisture deodorants, good Lord. I kinda wanna fix it up, hang on. Straighten things out just a little bit if I can. Maybe not. It's kind of. Okay, how about if we. Okay, I'm seeing also new Dove bar soaps that we hadn't seen. I think at the Walmart we saw the berry and the milk and willow, but now they have coconut milk and sugar lychee. Oh, that smells divine. That smells so good. And then they have turmeric, milk, and lemon drop. We really like this one too. I love all these cleansing bars that they've came out with. They all smell really, really good. I think we just go ahead and get them all. I found this Dove Invigorating Aloe and Eucalyptus Oil. It smells really crisp, clean. I actually love the scent. I think it's gonna be perfect for summer. So I'm looking now for a deodorant to kind of match with it. There's quite a few options I feel like I could go. I found this native one with eucalyptus and mint. Then we have like cucumber would go really well with it. The green teas. I don't think the new Vitamin Care Cucumber and Melon would go with this at all. I love the Vitamin Care line, but it doesn't exactly go with this body wash. I wanted to smell these Bioma washers, but I literally cannot get these open. This one, I didn't really like the smell of it, but I can't open those at all. And look what I'm seeing. This has to be new. Multi-oil body butter from Glow Getter. I love the Naturium body wash of that, and I've never seen the body butter. So definitely think I'm gonna get this. So noticing Naturium has new body washes. Energizer and the Booster. I've never seen these colors before. Surprisingly, I actually like the smell of this debating on getting this one. It smells really good. Have we seen Beloved body washes before? They have Calm, Dream, Vibe, and Indulge. Oh gosh, caught that. My God, that smells like vomit. I, okay, no, definitely not. I'm not calm when I smell that. I'm not calm at all, actually. This one smells a little bit better, but I'm not even gonna bother with the rest. It's, well, you know what? Let me give them all a try. Okay, no, smells like ass. I don't like any of those. Stopping in my tracks. 
Do they have the one I'm looking They don't have the one I'm looking for, but I'm seeing one we haven't seen yet. Soothing Relief, 5% Nourishing Serum with Collodial Oatmeal. Fragrance free. Oh my gosh. How do they not have the one scent I'm looking for? Okay, Missy is, yeah, you see? She's not having any more of it. So we're gonna check out. This was kind of a quick one, but I did get quite a few stuff. So I'll show you guys everything I got when I get home. I know, baby. We're going home. I like it. I found actually, if I just put her in the main part where she can dance to the music, she's actually quite content. <laughs> there she goes. Look at her go. This has nothing to do with hygiene, but I'm getting Kale stuff. I got his swimsuit for his Easter basket, and I'm gonna get him a couple outfits. I kinda like this, and I wanna match it with some like pink shorts, I think, because of the pink of the hat, that would be cool. If I can find his size. Let's see. I've gotten Navy and Imran a ton of outfits, so. Oh, here we go, perfect. They don't have any more of the pink, unfortunately, but the blue might be cool. Purple or pink shorts would have looked better with it. Okay, now that I just probably got like hundreds of dollars worth of clothes for the kids, now we're gonna check out and I'll show you guys everything I picked up when I get home. <laughs> she was all smiling at everybody. Imran! Hi! <laughs> all right, so we're here back home. I'm gonna show you everything I picked up. No, I said this was gonna be a hygiene haul, but I'm just gonna show you guys what I picked up clothes-wise as well. I actually got a bunch of other stuff that I'm not gonna show in this haul that I got for like the Easter baskets. There is some of this stuff that's gonna go in the Easter baskets that I'm showing you. It's just like miscellaneous items, and I'll show that in a different video. It, I picked these shark swim trunks up for Kale. Those are gonna go in his Easter basket. I told you guys everyone's gonna get a swimsuit. So this is what I picked out for him. I already had the girls in a different video. Navy this is just everyday clothes this won't be in the basket but I got her this little skirt with a green shirt thought that was really pretty and I got her this pink floral shirt with these jean shorts with the lace at the bottom Imran I've gotten her quite a few spring and summer clothes already I didn't get her much today but I did pick this up just because it still is a little chilly out and this was on sale. In fact, all the Cat and Jack stuff, this is Cloud Island, but all the Cat and Jack stuff was on sale today too. I got her this little set, thought it was cute. And I also got Navy some socks, these purple shorts with this top here, the little flower peace sign. I didn't realize actually until just now that I got her all a bunch of floral stuff, but <laughs> I got this purple flower dress for her as well because she said it looks like a princess dress. So, Kale, I got him this tank top with the palm trees, which I actually thought this shirt was pretty cool in color scheme. And I got him some black shorts to match. I didn't realize it was a long sleeve shirt when I picked it up, but that's okay. Like I said, it's still a little chilly out. I got him this shark shirt with these blue shorts. And then lastly, I got him this T-Rex hip hop shirt with some green athletic shorts. So these are pretty thin. And then these are like a really thick cotton material. Now for hygiene, I already had this Naturium Glow Getter body wash and this Dewy Daisy. I showed you guys in my last hygiene haul, but I just wanted to show you it together with the Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Butter. I've never tried any of Naturium's like body creams, lotions, or obviously this body butter. So I'm really excited to try this because I love the Glow Getter body wash. It doesn't really have a distinct smell to it in my opinion. So I think it could really go with this Dewy Daisy, even though this is very floral. I do still want to try a floral squad to go with this scrub specifically but I think that this will work for now. It will be a good summer scent. Also, I'll be putting this Glow Getter Body Butter in my Easter basket. Then also for my Easter basket, I'm gonna try out this Bioma Creamy Jelly Cleanser. I just got the travel size because I did just get face wash, but I really wanna try Bioma. I got this to put in Kale's Easter basket. I ended up picking the Native Lemon Deodorant. I feel like lemon products are just really hard to come by, and this actually smells really good to me. This would pair well with this if I wanted to. I also think pineapple and lemon are a good mix if you want to kind of mix match scents. I think they go really well together. And I know there's a bunch of pineapple products out there that I really do love. 
So I got that for this. I don't know any pineapple deodorants, at least not off the top of my head. I feel like in my last kind of pineapple hygiene squad, I didn't have a pineapple deodorant, but I think lemon goes really well with that. And I went ahead and got the Tropic Glow kind of fragrance shimmer mist and I'm putting this in my Easter basket and then I got the scrub and body wash I won't be putting these two in there because there's other things that I want to put you guys I'm going to be filling my own Easter basket so whatever I want to put in there I'm going to put in there and then I did get the turmeric milk and lemon drop this isn't very lemony as far as like this deodorant goes it's kind of woodsy in my opinion it has a very kind of wood type scent but I do love it I really want to see what the bars look like should we open one up it's pretty plain i don't know why i thought it was gonna have like spreckles in it i thought it was gonna I be like kind Misha. of you like it i thought it was gonna be a little bit lighter in cream color soap wise like and then it was gonna have like those spreckles and brown spreckles or whatever but that's fine it's cute i like the little dove in there obviously or i thought it was gonna have like the swirls kind of on the packaging oh that is powerful out of the box i mean strong it is in my nose hairs i think this one might be my favorite the coconut milk and sugar lychee is it lychee or lychee guys help me out i really like this one i think it's going to go with so much all of the coconut stuff that i had it has a very sweet scent to it so i think it could pair with a lot i'm gonna assume this is similar it looks kind of actually identical in color so this beloved pineapple and papaya body cream smells divine. I'm not even kidding y'all. I moaned when I smelled it. Not exaggerating at all. Now, the body washes that I smelled, is was it beloved that I was like gagging at? Yeah, definitely not. But this, this smells so good. This did come with a body wash. Other products, I didn't bother picking that up. So I think it's Olay that has my favorite pineapple body wash. I need to double check. This body cream, I've actually never used any of their products. It is a godsend. Like, oh my God, yummy. This toothpaste up for Kale's Easter basket. And then I got this one for Navy's Easter Basket. I got this bubblegum scented Somebody Loves You Holler and Glow Bath Bomb for Navy's Easter Basket. And for my basket, I've never seen this brand, heard of this brand, or obviously tried it. But I saw it in like the Ulta part of Target. And I was thinking it's going to match perfectly with the color scheme that I have going on in my basket. Picked it up, this Mind Glowing Peel Off Mask, Hit Snooze Lip Mask. And then also for my basket, lucky for me, kind of the light blues were the color scheme of my Easter basket. Pick up this Flamingo Exfoliating Shave Gel and Post Shave Serum. I told you guys my last hygiene haul that I was eyeing this and felt like this was a perfect time for me to try it. And this is for their pubic line. Also for my Easter basket, I picked up the Energizer Mandelic Acid Body Wash. This smells so, so good. This Holler and Glow Pink Lemonade Scented Chick Shaped Bath Bomb for Kale's Easter Basket, since y'all know his basket was kind of that blue and yellow theme. Also going in my Easter basket is this Bloom Variety Pack Mango Berry Strawberry Kiwi. I've seen this all over TikTok. I want to give it a go. Again, my basket's going to be stuff that I've never tried before. Supposed to help with bloating. And I thought the flavors sounded good. So I'm excited to try that. Picked up this Finery Pistachio Please. It. This smells so yummy. Like, I really can't express how happy this perfume smell makes me. Like, it just screams springtime and summer. You know, pistachio could smell so good. You know what I'm saying? I love to eat pistachios. And in a scent, I was like, what is that going to smell like? This came down from heaven personally. And here's a new kind of scent for me. I don't think I've ever worked with anything aloe and eucalyptus as far as like my hygiene shower routines. I don't think this is a scent I've ever really touched. Surprised that I found this and liked it. I thought the eucalyptus would really throw me off because it's not typically a scent I would go for, but the aloe just really kind of balances out. I actually think this is great smelling. And I'm going to pair it with the eucalyptus and mint native deodorant. I don't know what scrub I would pair with this just yet. There might be a Dr. Teal's actually. Like, oh, you know what? The Dr. Teal's cannabis one. And I think they have a eucalyptus one. I think those would go really well with this. I didn't see it at Target today. But I know I've tried that cannabis one before. And I absolutely love that Dr. Teal scrub. And I'm thinking about it now. It will go perfectly with this. So this is Mando. I'm pretty sure this is by the brand Lumi. Because they were paired right next to each other. Like in a display. But it's called Mando. And this bourbon leather smells so good. I'm going to put this in Kale's Easter basket. I don't really like. Oh. 
Hello. I don't really like the packaging of this. They could have done a little better. Like, even though it's for men, could have, aesthetics-wise, gone a little further. You know what I'm saying? But it smells freaking good. My boy be stinking lately. He's... Oh, y'all. <laughs> My son is getting to the age. He stinks. Like, please put some deodorant on and some cologne because my nose hurts. Putting this in my Easter basket because my colors were like blue, peach, and a little bit of yellow. I'm adding this hydrogel mask set from Loops, the weekly reset one. They have different like titles and I didn't notice that until today. I'm wanting to try this brand. So I picked that up. Like my peach theme, I got the Bioma Balancing Face Mist, which I'm really excited to try because I don't have any type of face mist. I don't think I've ever really used a face mist now that I'm thinking about it. Milk and Berry Brulee. I lied. This one's actually my favorite and that one is close, close tie for first, but it's going to be second. This one smells so good and this just looks like a little bit pinker. This will go with so, so much. So, so much. So this... I really only got for one reason. So the O whale, I say this so much, but I, when I text it or whatever, I put the whale emoji. When I saw that that was the title for this, I was like, I have to get it because that is my saying. The Jergens Melanin Glow with bronze luminizers. And then for Navy's Easter Basket, I got the Burt's Bees Shea Passion Fruit and Oil. I should have got myself some chapstick. I didn't even think about that because I could always use chapstick. All right, so that is going to be it for this haul. Hygiene, clothes, and like I said, I got a ton more for the Easter baskets, but I'm gonna show that in a different video. I hope you all enjoyed this one. I hope you liked this haul. Have a great rest of your weekend, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.